humans, I'm Yo Schiller. Welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. Today's video is going to be formatted a bit differently. I feel like I've been saying that a lot as of late, so if all of my videos are different, do I need to keep saying that? Well, I'm going to say it anyway, because here's the scoop. I have a bunch of friends that are in a call right now, and they're going to be joining me for a different video that I'm recording that will be uploaded at a different time. However, my friend Lee, the one that appeared just a couple days ago that I traded Nook Miles tickets with, is about to fulfill her end of the trade by giving me... Fish bait. She wanted Nook Miles tickets. I wanted fish bait. I gave her the Nook Miles tickets. She had to go and make the fish bait. Now she has the fish bait. Now she's gonna give it to me. Oh, Isabel actually has something to say. It's almost the end of January, isn't it? We're already through one month of the new year. February is likely to be chilly as well. Make sure to stay bonded up so you don't catch any colds. Yeah, I think this is. Oh, whoa. I think this is the last month to actually feature snow. I think maybe by February 10th or maybe February 20th, the snow was gonna be gone. Because when we get back to March, it's got to be approaching springtime, and we'll be approaching the one-year anniversary of this game, which is kind of crazy to think about. Anyway, okay, so Lee is going to come over to my island. She's going to drop off fish bait. I'm not going to record my whole hour of gameplay for Animal Crossing right now. I try to record an hour of Animal Crossing every single day, and I try to do it in one continuous session, but there have been one or two instances where I've broken up the day, where I recorded one chunk at one time of the day, and one chunk at another time of the day. This is one of those days where I'm going to have to split this up, because I do not have time to record an Animal Crossing gameplay video for an hour right now. I will get this fish bait, and then I will play sometime in the evening. And that at that time, that's when I'll go on with the rest of my day, where I will have to catch 50 fish, 40 bugs, and 20 deep sea creatures. For the time being, I'm going to go ahead and get my gate open. I figure I can just connect to online play and we'll just do a regular gate opening thing, no dodo code. And then I'm actually going to rejoin the call with my friends right now. And I'm going to start recording co-commentary for a bit. This whole video isn't going to be co-commentated. Just this next bit where I get my fish bait because my friends are waiting on me so I may as well chat with them. I just wanted to go ahead and do... This introduction first, so yeah, I'm gonna cut ahead. I'll see you guys in a moment, and it's gonna be co-commentary for like the next five minutes. Woo! Uh, Nera has joined the chat. Hi, Nera. Hello. And he's gonna come to my Animal Crossing island for the first time to give me fish bait, and then we can fish bait. Do whatever today. All right. God. Fish bait. Wow. Fish bait. Wow. <laughs> Is there a reference here? I'm not finding getting... Nemo. Uh, it's finding Nemo. <laughs> okay, what's the source? Because I know the line is shark bait, ooh ah, but I don't know. Oh, that's it. It's uh... uh. Yeah, it's 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 finding Nemo. <laughs> it's um, it's when they're talking about Nemo and the fish tank. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's Nemo. Okay. Yeah, it is Nemo. <laughs> that's the one. Thank you. Shark bait, ooh ah. -ah. Mm-hmm. And since they're treat or Lee's giving a shiller fish bait, I said fish bait. Ooh, ha, ha. That's the joke. What? I yes. explained it. Ha, 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 it's ha, like ha, a ha. dad joke. Haha, ha, I'm laughing. I'm sorry, I'm so tired. I'm, I'm No, tired. it's fine. Dodo. I hate dodo birds. Oh. oh. Well, you don't well, have to worry about them anymore, there. I guess. <laughs> yeah, they're extinct. <laughs> They did it to themselves. <laughs> oh, hey. So, you've never seen my island before. I hope you like what you see. And I'm still willing to give you a full tour on a different day. But for now, as soon as we're yeah. done with this exchange, I'm going to back out of here and finish recording my Animal Crossing video later this evening. You're going to do whatever it is you have to do. And I am going to do some stuff with Charles Scooter and Nara today. Oh, let me guess. Here. Your force swords game. We're gonna force swords, yeah. yeah. Yep, That's we're gonna fun. fork swords. That's what. Oh <laughs> my That's god. What it is. <laughs> or is it fork sporks? Oh. Uh, I like sporks. I don't really use. Four people with swords. I like papoons. Mm. <laughs> I'm excited to see your island later. Oh my god, it looks so cool Thank already. Thank you. It's fun showing newer, newer players my island. Because oftentimes when I invite people to my island, it's... Let me put it to you this way. I admire things that I can't do. Like, I love your guys' artwork. Because I know I can't do it. But I have a hard time admiring certain videos on YouTube because I know how they edit certain things. 
and it takes the magic out of it. <laughs> so, like... <laughs> I understand. It's fun showing newer players my island, because it's like, oh, you're still learning how half this stuff works, so I can show off a little bit. <laughs> yes. Well, come right. on over All here. Right, and I, I have two extra goodies for you. So here's two more Nook Miles tickets and two Bell Vouchers for the road. Oh, thank you. Sell you sell the Bell Vouchers, right, each one's worth 3,000 Bells. Thank You're you. You're welcome. Thank you. Who left? I'm going to kill them. <coughs> Emma is AFK because she has to do stuff right now. Oh, I won't. No, she, she's different. <laughs> if it was anybody <laughs> else. Hey, <bro>. anybody else. <laughs> How many did you make? A lot. How much a is a lot? Because I've got a more. big smile on my face right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to get more, so everything I make, is it, it's all going to be But you're going to get more? Yeah, I'm not done. Yeah, I'm going to get more. This is what I got you're so welcome. far. <laughs> Thank oh, you. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, here, let me... Did you use uh, Nick Mile tickets to get Audi? Yeah, you said, you said you got oh, Audi, you... right? Is that how you got her? Was through the Nick yeah. Mile tickets I gave you? No. Yes, 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 it was, yes, it was, yes, it was. Yay, happy to be the sister. <laughs> I... mm -hmm. Yes, um. <clears throat> Wait a minute. I, uh. What? Oh, no, you're not, you're not supposed to come over, Toon Zelda. All right, Toon Zelda's coming Toon, over. Who is this? Uh, I don't think she's ever been to my island before, either. Darn it. We probably uh, should have done oh. Dodo Did... codes, I'm sorry. Yeah, no, it's okay. <clears throat> Did they get, uh, like, uh, like... I don't, I don't know, know what's going to happen today now. Know. I don't know what she's going to do. I ha I can't <laughs> devote my focus to her. I didn't know she was going to come over. Yes, you can. It's easy. What, you want me to kick her? <laughs> no, 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 okay. you're fine. I'm, uh, I have all the stuff right there for you. Okay, was that, was that all I'm of it? Because then I can, make I can more... kick you off or I can... Yeah. I don't know. I don't know yeah, let me uh, pick up the other thing first and then I'll get off of you. Sure. All right, hi, Toon Zelda. This is an ex I hate how long this this uh, intro thing is. I know, but... I know. This game could stand to have some quicker loading times. Or at least to give an option to have it load faster. Oh. Like, yes. If both parties have faster <coughs> directions or whatever enabled, it does it. But if it's not, then basically it has to be a double po a double positive for it to activate fast mode. My pockets are almost all fish bait, thank you. Yeah, no problem. I'm gonna uh, get you more later too so that you can uh crazy. Have an time. I appreciate it. Okay, I <laughs> Well uh have fun everyone. Alright, bye. Ah! <laughs> all right, see you later. <laughs> uh all right, I guess I'll pick up these other ones real quickly. It's been nearly 10 years. All right, I'm gonna Okey leave. Okie dokie. This is a rather awkward time <laughs> to have a reunion, Toon Zelda. I'm sorry. Turn to my island. Turn to my island, yes. Thank you for the little extras. Yeah, thank you for the fish bait. Trust me, this fish bait helps me more than you may ever know. Unless you watch my videos, in which case you'll know exactly how much it helps me. Um, I, ta I did talk to Charles about it because I was like, I didn't know how much to give and stuff. So Charles was telling me about it. So I... The more the merrier. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to keep doing fish bait stuff. <laughs> yeah, Charles, is that what you and told her? He like, was like, like, she what? was like, how much fish bait does your shiller need? And you were just like, anything you have, give it to him. <laughs> I, uh, well, I essentially said like, oh, he's trying to essentially try to complete the game before so and such date. And, uh, the more the merrier, basically. For sure. Yeah, I'll have more fish bait next time, and then I'll come over, and then I'll give you oh, way that's, more. That's fine. Bait. Do you need more Nook Miles tickets? Because I can get you more. I love Nook Miles tickets. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. But I'm also doing this because, uh, I'm trying to get more Nook Miles tickets. Uh, so I'm just digging up all the clams and stuff. Uh, but for every clam I get, I'm making it into fish bait, and I'm giving it to you because I know that you need it. Because I'm not going to use the fish bait. I don't care about fish oh. bait. Oh. So well, that I'll works. Just give it all to you. That works out very <laughs> well because I don't care about my Nook Miles. Oh my god, perfect! <laughs> and I also like oh, the people I'm looking for is specifically 
uh, Coco. I'm looking for Coco as well. And yeah. Raymond. Is, um, is Coco a, so a gorilla? Which Coco? No, Coco. Uh, for, uh, sorry, bunny with the hollow. It's the eye. bunny that I that I want if I ever play the Animal Crossing. Oh, okay. Never mind. I don't want Coco. I want the. I want Lucky. I want Lucky. My oh, the, oh, to go with, to go with Anka. Why isn't <laughs> yes, Co Why but... isn't Coco a gorilla? Cause... I don't know. It's like Coco. I hate the Coco is the famous name of a gorilla that knew sign language. <gasps> oh. Sh well, I don't think Nintendo gives a shit, to be honest. Nintendo's just like, you know what? We're gonna name you this. Good luck. Maybe. But okay, I will talk to y'all later, and I will get more fish bait, too. I appreciate it. Thank you, Lee. No problem. Bye, Bye y'all. I'm gonna die. Bye, Lee. Bye. She dead her, her quote is, Don't put it off till tomorrow what you can do to... Oh, don't put off till tomorrow what you can do today. What is... Wow, that's... That's an inspiring quote from Coco. What is today, but yesterday's tomorrow. <laughs> I can't believe her quote is from Benjamin Franklin. Insane. This bunny with the... the it shouldn't know, surprise me, but I did not know Benjamin Franklin was the origin of that quote. <clears throat> there you go. That's, that's Coco. Let me have a look. Let me look up that Coco. Oh, that's Coco? That's not what I thought Coco looked like. Her name's Coco because she looks like a coconut. Oh, you know, now holes. the joke makes more sense. <laughs> Did you know that's why Coco says Coco and fosters home for imaginary friends? Because she's nuts. Because she's crazy. So I, I read that she's... the creator wanted Coco's <laughs> origin story to be that there was a kid on an island and the kid uh was on the verge of death basically and was going crazy and had to live off of coconuts so they wanted coconuts but they imagined a crazy bird instead. oh yeah it's the first made an imaginary friend to keep him company and was just like coconuts coconuts coco 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 and then made an imaginary friend and that only took coco. <laughs> Coco is a funny character. For now, I gotta say goodbye to Toon Zelda who came to my island. Sorry, Toon Zelda. Just really bad timing. That's what I'll tell her. It's bad timing. It's just bad timing. I don't, don't want to play with you anymore. I do want to play. I just can't play. I don't want. It's just. I love you. Yeah, we gotta do the Zelda. Zelda! It's just, we gotta play real Zelda, not Toon Zelda. Yeah, sorry Zelda, <laughs> Toon Zelda. You ain't in Smash, so you ain't real. <laughs> yeah, the Toon Zelda was gonna be in Brawl, allegedly. Oh yeah, I, I, I heard that. But she's not! <laughs> so, jokes on Zelda. Instead, they decided to make Sheik a separate character in the next game. Every and every Zelda plays on plays online the same. Don't you say that about like Palutena too? <laughs> yeah, you start to realize that any character yeah. that can be uh, that likes to hide in a corner plays the exact same way. And I say that as a, I say <laughs> that as a Min Min player. <laughs> oh, is Min Min kind of the same. Yeah, you basically too? hide in a corner and like make it impossible for your opponent to get to you. <laughs> At least that's how I do it. There are some really cool Min Min players. I say really cool, but I think people find them obnoxious. But there are some Min Min players who uh, can chase really well. Like, they knock their opponent off, they jump off the stage, and then hit them with their arms and then get back on stage. I'm not, I'm not that fast. I can't coordinate myself that quickly. But I, I and plenty of other Min Min players cower to a corner... Flail our arms around, and then when the opponent gets close, we just grab him. <laughs> you came into my no. You came into my no no square. It's time to die. Yeah, pretty much. I say that like I know what I'm doing in Smash. I don't even know if that's an advised way to play Min Min, but it's what I do. All right. Well, I'm gonna put Animal Crossing down for now. We can do what we need to do, and I'll I'll 
come back to this in like four or five hours and actually record an episode of this series. So, whoosh to Animal Crossing right now. Oh, all that recording we did wound up taking pretty much all day. Uh, but I'm still committed to recording Animal Crossing for an hour every day, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that now, and I'm glad I was able to record with my friends. It was fun. We knocked out a lot of stuff. Now, back to the task at hand. First, the mailbox. Nook mileage program. Thank you. Aha! I should have known. I should have known. Okay, one moment, please. This has got to go. And then I, I, I just got to, I got to use up these bags of fish bait. All right, so let me check my mail, and then I'm going to write down the numbers I got to get to today. So I'm going to take this package, thank you, and then I got to throw this away so as to keep space. Oh, I got to throw away your letter too, Tybalt. Sorry. And, ah. Uh, this random letter from Flick I got to throw away. That's from the time he sent me an Atlas Moth. How nice. And Boris, I got to throw this one away too. I'm sorry, man. All right. Oh, yeah. And then I got to go to the top. And we got to throw this one away. Thank you. Happy Home Academy. I've got an S rank house. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All that just so that I can future proof myself and get stuff later. Also, what is this? Tourist telescope. That's right. I did order one. I did order one, and I kind of just want to put it here. There it is. There you go, because I had to spend Nook Miles the other day. So there. Another object is now just sitting on my island. Okay. And because it's a later hour in the day. Oh, it's too late to go clothing shopping. Not that I really need to. But it shouldn't be too late to catch some fish. Let me catch this here fish. Uh, you know, you know what? No, no. Let me let me write down the numbers first before I catch any fish. So, I gotta catch 50 fish, 40 bugs, and 20 deep sea creatures. I have to get two, two, three, six, two fish. Okay. And then I've got to get two. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So two, eight, eight, six bugs. Two, eight, eight, six. And then the deep sea creatures is only 20, and that is 1128. All right, I can do that. And then I've got at least 100 bags of fish bait. So catching fish today should be pretty straightforward. Okay. So let's get this one without the need of any fish bait. And then I can use 49 bags of fish bait and catch the other fish. I'm trying to be quiet because I can't see it. I can only hear it. There it is. All right. There we go. Fish number one for the day obtained. Awesome. I think so as to speed up the process of doing things today. Oh, and then a bug immediately. Awesome. To speed up the process today, I don't think I'm going to go inside my shop if I need to sell things. I'm just going to... I'm just going to use the drop-off box. It's probably what I should have been doing from the get-go. I don't really need bells right now, so this is just how we're going to do things from now on. Alright, I'm going to stand in my little spot right here. We're going to start chucking fish bait in. And after I've gone through like three or four sets of fish bait, we're going to see how many more, we're, we're gonna see how many more fish I have to catch. And then when I'm done catching fish for the day, we'll move on with the bug catching and the deep sea diving. Haven't even caught the wasps yet today, and I haven't even checked my little ant supply over to the right. So I'm hoping I can just power through this. And then maybe again on a future day, I will get additional fish bait or something. We'll see. But for now, all these bags of fish bait are going to make things, oh, so much easier. Let's go. That's not going to count, is it? Oh, why? Why did you spawn slightly to the left? All right. Do you see that one? Give that a try. There you go. Wait. Wait. There it is. Okay. All set. Thank you. Okay, and yep, inventory <laughs> is immediately full. Uh, both good and bad. Both good and bad. All right, scatter more food. Yeah, right there. Right there. Go get it. Go get it. Now we're talking. Wait. Aha! Very good. Okay, just powering through this. Already, my fourth fish for the day. And I can put that one in my pockets because I just went through a slot of fish bait. Now let's go through this slot. Let's do it. There we go. It's not spawning right in front of me, but it's close enough so that I can cast my lure immediately and catch the fish right afterward. So, 
Guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you a little bit of a story while I go ahead and catch these fish. So Lee is the person who gave me the fish bait. I only met her for the first time two days ago when I recorded that Animal Crossing video where she wanted Nook Miles. Or Nook Miles tickets, more specifically. Alright, so I'm part of a friend group. That's the one that has Charles and Emma and all those guys in it. And I chat with them on a regular basis. We keep each other company during these quarantine times. Because it's good to be, it's good to keep in touch with friends. It's it's a way to boost our social lives when we can't go outside. And even prior to quarantining, prior to having to stay home all the time, we chatted with each other on a regular basis anyway. You know, they were, they've been in my Smash videos and Mario Kart videos over the years. But these days we chat with each other just almost on a regular basis. But there's a lot of people in this chat that I just haven't really met yet. And that included Lee. And so, you know, she's still a person in the chat. And if she wants assistance and if she wants to hang out, uh, she, you know, she's allowed to be assisted and she's allowed to hang out. So she wanted Nook Miles and Emma also wanted Nook Miles. I keep saying Nook Miles. If I keep doing that, whoops, a fish got away. Oh, now I got to make up for that by catching a fish without the need of fish bait. Okay, well, anyway, uh, the, the people in this chat, I chat with them a lot and they're cool to hang out with and if they want help in Animal Crossing then I can help them and they wanted Nook Miles tickets and I told them well I've got 600,000 Nook Miles lying around I may as well use them do you mind if I record an Animal Crossing video where I do nothing but buy Nook Miles and they're like yeah we don't mind yeah, yeah, yeah. so I spoke with Lee some more after we recorded that video and Lee told me about a place called Raising Cane's, which is a chicken tender place. And this conversation came about one way or another because we were talking about popular fast food chains where they're made to be a big deal, but some people don't always see what the big deal is. And a prime example of that is In-N-Out. I quite like In-N-Out. I eat it pretty regularly, at least with regards to the fast food I eat in general. In-N-Out is usually a common pick. And I think it is worth the hype, but there are many people who might not agree. Now, In-N-Out is a burger place, and Raising Cane's is like the equivalent of In-N-Out, but for chicken tenders. And I was familiar with Raising Cane's because Raising Cane's has a few locations here where I live in Southern California. Man, it's just one thing after another. It's fine. I will continue the story. Raising Cane's has a few locations here in Southern California, and one is at least somewhat near to where I used to compete in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate back when the world was not quarantined. Every Wednesday, I used to go to Wednesday Night Fights. And that took place in Santa Ana. So there's at least a Raising Cane's somewhat close to there. And a lot of Smash players would go to Raising Cane's after competing for the night because they... Because Raising Cane's is open until 3.30 in the morning. So Wednesday night fights, you compete from about 8 p.m. to midnight. And then after midnight, when you're done competing, you go and get your chicken tenders. And I was invited to go to Raising Cane's once or twice. And I had to turn down the offer because I had to get up for editing work the following day because I was still working for the completionist. And I was still going to the office every day and doing that work. So I can't, staying up till midnight, driving home, and then getting back up at about 7 o'clock. Not the greatest combo of things I could be doing. So staying up till 2 a.m. to get chicken tenders and then going back to work at, or getting up at 7 to go back to work. I probably shouldn't do that every week. So I never went to Raising Cane's. But Lee brought it up, and I mentioned, oh, you know, yeah, there's definitely some places in California, but I've never been. And she said, well, you gotta go. And I said, I mean, I guess I could go, but the one that's closest to where I live now is at least 30 miles away. And I don't know if I want to drive that far for some chicken tenders. And then she said, oh, yeah. I bet you wouldn't drive 30 miles for chicken tenders or something. And I said, is that a challenge? Are you challenging me? Do you not think I can do it? You shouldn't challenge me to these things. You're talking to the same guy who walked over seven and a half miles to get Krispy Kreme donuts. You're talking to the same guy who travels across the country just to compete in Super Smash Brothers. Who traveled to another country to compete in Super Smash Brothers. And you don't think I'm gonna drive 30 miles to get chicken tenders? She like reverse psychology me. And as you can expect, I did indeed drive 30 miles to get chicken tenders. And I got the chicken tenders. 
and they were pretty darn good, and I would not mind having Raising Cane's again, but the thing she didn't tell me about Raising Cane's, but the thing I probably should have deduced based on the whole reason we had this conversation, was that the line for Raising Cane's was super long! I- I've never seen such a huge line for a fast food restaurant, and I go to In-N-Out all the time. Alright? Raising Cane's, at least this Raising Cane's location on a Friday night, had a drive through line that was so long, it basically wrapped around the entire parking lot twice, and this parking lot is one of those big parking lots that is, you know, you park to go see a movie because there's a movie theater there. There's a few other smaller restaurants there. There's like a pharmacy there. Uh, I don't exactly know the part of California that it was in, but it, I had to go south of downtown Los Angeles to get to it, so... I, I, it, it was crazy how long the line was. It must have been an hour and a half to two hour wait in the drive-thru. So I did not go through the drive-thru. I waited outside the building and stood there with a few other people. And that line was also pretty long. And it still took me about an hour to get my food. It was good. But I don't know that I would wait an hour to get food ever again. It's one thing when you're sitting at a restaurant and you have appetizers and you're chatting with friends and you order food and the maybe the restaurant's really busy that night but an hour for fast food after I already spent basically an hour driving down there but you know what during these quarantine times I have to go and seek my own adventures I have to go and make my own stories and that's the type of story that's right up my alley and although the whole story is I drove to a place to get chicken tenders. I got the chicken tenders and I drove back. It is totally in my nature to say, well, I drove 30 miles to get chicken tenders, waited in line for an hour, and then drove 30 miles back. And at least the chicken tenders were good. And I would have them again. I just, I don't want to have to wait an hour to get them again, you know? So, that's my story. That's what I did recently. That's what I did just after I recorded. What day would that have been? Day 295 of Animal Crossing? Like, we got done recording, we chatted for about another 30 minutes or so, and then I spent basically three hours getting chicken tenders. So that ate up most of my day. But again, it gives me a story to tell, because most of us are staying inside these days, and so, you know, the common question people ask is, what have you been up to lately? And I'm not trying to sound rude, but a lot of people ask that, and it's like, what do you want me to say? What have I been up to lately? I've been playing Animal Crossing, I've been catching 50 fish per day. I don't- I don't know what else you want me to say. So I always- Well- uh, wow! I'm just- I'm missing all the fish today! Okay, I gotta go get another one. Oh wait, let me get that. So you know, it's- it's- I gotta- I gotta go make my adventures. And that so-called adventure was me getting chicken tenders. That's all I'm trying to say. It's something somewhat exciting that I- it, it's- it's a little thing that I did recently that I thought was worth sharing, that resulted from a discussion from one of my Animal Crossing videos. So Animal Crossing is still continuing to change my life, that's all. Alright, that's that recent story. Now, I kind of wish there was more to the story, but I'm kind of glad that there wasn't. I'm glad that there wasn't anything like- And then a fight broke out when I was at Raising Cane's! No, 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 no. None of that. But, yeah, that's, that's, that's my life. What's the most interesting thing I did recently? Got chicken tenders. Oh, now, uh, yeah, you know what? I knew that was going to break after like one or two more fish. So let me go craft another one. I can do so up here. I had six tree branches, right? So I should be able to craft another one. Easy peasy. All right, there we go. Let's craft. So my first time speaking... Oh, wow, do I not? Oh, I have one tree branch. Okay. Well, then let's take a mini break. Let's go inspect the trees today real quickly and get wasps. And then when I'm done... Oh, oh, I can't catch that fish right now. Okay. When I'm done catching wasps... Oh, there's a damselfly? Well, if it comes all the way up here, I can catch it. But what I'm trying to say is I want to catch the wasps right now because I have to shake the trees to get wasps. And I also have to shake the trees to get tree branches. So I may as well... Oh my god. Alright, fine. That damselfly is a lost cause. I may as well get the wasps right now because I have to shake trees anyway. And I've got a fresh net ready to go. So let's just get a bunch of tree branches. So let's get that. Let's shake this tree. Cool. Wasps. Awesome. I should actually be able to carry this wasp. Yeah. But I actually don't want to hang on to it. I... Okay, well, you know what? We'll get rid of the ant. 
What I actually want to do is I want to hang on to the wasp nest so I can keep track of how many wasps I've caught today in case I start forgetting. Oh, nope, I don't want the flower. I want this. And there's a balloon! Let me... Ah, uh, I guess I could hop over real quickly and pop it if I'm quick enough. Hurry, hurry, hurry! Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wisp is here! Frick, alright. No, wait! Ah! Uh, alright, Wisp, I'm gonna deal with you in a moment. I, I want to get another fishing rod before I forget. And then I will assist you. I'm glad you're here, Wisp. I am glad you're here. Oh, furniture? Okay, not exactly what I need right now. We'll go ahead and toss this fish back in the water. Take that. Okay. More tree branches! Cool. Ooh, okay. Alright. So again, I don't need the wasps. Not worried about making money right now. I'm just getting the wasp nests to keep track of stuff. So now we get that. And then we get that. So that's only my second wasp though, right? Yeah. Okay, so there's still three more to get. Awesome. Here we go, here is number three. Thank you. Alright, good, 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 good. Yeah, busy day. Started the day off with with fish bait, and then uh, another friend randomly came to my island, and now I gotta help Wisp. Alright, it's a change of pace, and I told you guys my chicken tender story. Huzzah! Doing things! So what have I been up to lately? Well, a random person came to my island, I got a bunch of fish, fish bait, and now Wisp is here. We take those. I only gotta help Wisp two more times, so I, I better help him today. Okay, this one has furniture. Espresso maker. Okay. Go by Dab. I'll take the espresso maker. Now, one of these trees still needs to have a wasp in it, right? Because I've only caught the four? Yeah. So, it could be this tree, or it could be the one tree that's down south probably gonna be the one tree that's down south because I don't feel like this tree gives me very much these days because there's too many flowers around it. I understand. I understand. Okay. Let me check down here then. And is there gonna be a dung beetle? Not on that snowball. Where's... Ah, oh, but there is one on that snowball. Yeah, there you go. You're not pushing that snowball into the water. Nope. In fact, if anyone's gonna accidentally push it into the water, it's me. Let me kick this to the left. Yep, I knew it would be me. I'm such a doofus. All right. Hey, there's a bug on this tree stump. Awesome. Extra bugs! Meeting that bug quota! Alright. Great. Let it go. Goodbye. Alright, now this tree will have wasps in it. Yeah, baby. Catch that. Okie dokie. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then we're gonna let this go. Alright, so now I'm just gonna shake this tree a bunch of times. Get some tree branches. Okay, I, I want to get to like 11 tree branches. So I'm at 10, perfect. I just got to get one more. Perfect! Thank you. I know I'm going to need a lot more tree branches later if I want to craft enough tools by the end of the game. But for now, this will get me a basic fishing rod and it will allow me to craft one additional tool later on. So, aha! Yes, of course. I should have known. Okay, goodbye, wasp. Now we deal with this. Okay. So, let's craft. Let's do this now. So, flimsy fishing rod. Very good, very good, very good. And then we upgrade this to a regular fishing rod. Okay. Hup, hup, hup. You know, I, I might be able to meet the fish quota today. I don't know if I'm going to meet all the quotas today if I'm about to help Wisp right now. Oh, another balloon. My shot at redemption. Okay. Watch out. Watch out, Mac. Here we go. Three. Two. One. Duh! Yeah, that's not going to line up at all. Try that. Try that. There it is. Okay. So now I shall catch this fish. We'll see what's inside the package. And then we're going to go ahead and spook wisp. That's not going to work, huh? What if I go on this side and try it? Give that a whirl. Ha-ha! There it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Darn it! I don't want trash right now. All right, drop it. But then it stays on the land, right? Ah! All right, here's what we gotta do then. Release that, and then this. And what is this? Open that up. It is school desk. All right, I gotta, I gotta go sell stuff. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta sell stuff. I don't need all. Well, okay, hang on. Wisp, peg tight for one moment. Mac, here, you can have an item. Okay, hey, what's up? Do you want this? Do you want the? 
espresso maker because you can have it. I do not need it. Okay, there you go. Awesome. 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 Okay. Tropical hat. Thanks, man. You know what? Just to have extra inventory space, I'm going to go ahead and put that on right now. Oh, yeah, baby. All right. Actually, it looks kind of cool. All right. Now, what's the deal with this? This is boom, boom. Open that. Okay. Already know it. All right. All right. Wisp, my good man. Hello. It's not the first time I've. It's not the first time I've scared you in this exact spot either. I know that for a fact. Hello. Okay, it is me. I just gotta startle you and help you two more times, and then I don't have to do this ever again. I probably should do this ever again because you'll give me items I don't have yet. But for now, let's just knock this out. I have to keep catching bugs regardless. So. I will be on the lookout. I will keep my net out. I will catch an ant if it has spawned over here. Also a hermit crab if it has spawned over here. I'm not seeing a hermit crab. Hmm, there are ants though. Nice. Well, hey, I think I've caught at least 10 bugs today so far. I'm already a quarter of the way done with catching bugs today, if that's true. What do you say we have a quick look-see and just see how I'm doing? So I'm at 2330 fish. I have to catch 32 more. Okay, I got a lot of work to do on that one. And then the bugs, I'm at 2859. I have to catch 27 more. Well, hey, I have caught... Yeah, I, okay. So if I have to catch 27 more, I've caught 13 bugs today already. That's pretty good. All right, I'll get this fish real quickly too. Because it's me catching fish without the need of fish bait. But then I'm going to go stand back in my spot and I'm going to use more fish bait. I'm trying to, you know, utilize my fish bait as best as I can. But I do have it, so I may as well use it. I don't have to be this conservative about it. Wait. Oh, man. Thank you. Okie dokie. That will do extra fish. No need. And let it go. Alright. So let me stop by the drop-off box. Throw a few items in there. And then, yeah, now then I gotta go and try and catch those spirits. Alright, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving. Moving, no fish in there, no worries. Is there a, a wasp over here? There is not. I'm not a wasp, a moth. Is there a moth over here? But even so, the answer is still no. Okay, so that, 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 and that. Wow, I, I have so much fish bait. This is such a good problem to have. Okay, so if I catch at least one spirit piece, that'll just save an inventory slot for it going forward. So, my spirit pieces love to just gravitate toward the lake of my island because that is the center of it all. I already saw that one spirit piece that was kind of over here. Yeah, but it was a little further south and I could go after that fish, but you are not my focus right now, fish. I mean, you, you will be, but I, I got fish bait for a reason. We'll make this work. Oh, that's a big old fish. All right, let's get it. Let's, can my lure even go that far? No. Will this fish ever turn around? Probably not. And it is not worth my time. I don't even know that I can get that. Hmm. Then we're going to chill here and see what happens first. This fish turning around and that spirit piece becoming accessible. We're going to give this a minute or so. And if neither one happens... Okay, that fish... that that th Those things are going to give me a headache if I keep staring at them. That fish is never going to turn around because it keeps getting pushed back. And that spirit piece is just floating over the water endlessly. Aha! But here's the spirit piece. Great. So now that I have an inventory slot dedicated to spirit pieces, I could go back to fishing if I wanted to. I'm going to still be on the lookout. Check my beaches. Hmm. That's not a bug. No worries. Probably should just finish up the fish quota real quickly, but I just... I, I, I do want to get these spirit pieces sooner rather than later. I don't want it to linger. Okay, you guys are chatting. Oh, spirit piece. Why you gotta be so impossible to get? Maybe I should go inside. Because that's not just one spirit piece that's lingering. There's two. And I, I could take apart some parts of my island to try and get that spirit piece. Okay, what's up, guys? All right, superhero workout. Yes, yes, I do. I totally hang on. Did you just say rah, rah? Wow, that sounds like it's some kind of super sweet move. Huh? It does. Rah, rah. Ha, ha, ha. It does. So awesome. Hey, we should both say it. That cool with you? It's very cool with me. Come on, let's both try it out. All right, ready? Turbo Muscle Force! Rawr, rawr! Activate! 
Great, now both the jocks on my island are gonna say rawr rawr. It's fine. Here, you know what? I haven't used- let me catch that fish. I haven't used the Nook Miles machine yet today either, so I could go and do that, and then I could order some more random stuff for my friends. So here we are, and... Hoppa. Okay, here we are. No, 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 you're not actually gonna see it. Hmm. Try that. Okay. Wait. Wait. There it is. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Okay, dokily. So now let's head inside using the Nook Miles machine, and then going inside and coming back outside, hopefully the spirit pieces on my island will spawn in more accessible locations. So here we are. Hi, everybody. So let me do this. Okay. Boom. Oh, I have used the machine today. That's right, because I got an extra... I got an extra bell voucher and an extra Nook Miles ticket. Okay, well then, whatever. I believe that there are... No. You know what I want to do? We're just gonna go. We're gonna go to Nook Shopping. Okay. We're gonna go to. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I know what I want to do. Okay. So, not the rugs. I wanted the posters. Oh, maybe it's it's under special goods. Okay. We're gonna send out a Celeste poster. We're gonna send some stuff to Lee. Okay. So Lee, here you go. Happy Valentine's Day, Lee. Here's a poster of Celeste. There you go. I'm gonna send you two items. And I actually have started receiving messages from my friends about how many random items I've sent them, and it is quite funny how <laughs> how it's all been adding up. Here, I'll give you a label poster too. I figure I figure label's a pretty safe character. People people tend to like her. Here, Happy Valentine's Day, Lee. There you go. All right. Thank you. Okay. So that's already two items sent to her. Now if I order any other item, it's got to go to someone else. So, what if I order a world map and we give that to Emma. Alright. Happy Valentine's Day, Emma. There you go. Item number three. And then we'll, do, we'll get two more items. So I can have purchased five items today. And then... Great, and then a world map for Charles, all right, great, 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 okay, thank you very much, excellent, excellent, okay, all set, and then one more world map, and we'll send that to, we'll send this one to, to, Cody. Here we go. Happy Valentine's Day, Cody. There you go. Sent the packages out. Very good, very good. Enjoy your world maps. Alrighty. Great, great, great. Alright, and thank you. Hmm. Okay, well, let's, let, let's see if those spirit pieces have spawned in better places, huh? Let's be on the lookout. <laughs> hey, whoa, what? Who lit a fire here and left it unattended? Hey. Hey. Well, it is warm. All right, well, whatever. I'll come back to it later. Who did that? You know what? No. This is an opportunity for me to sit in front of it and take my own pictures. All right. Here. I set the fire. How about that? Here, I got I got to get this out. So, boom. Da 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 huh. Mac no my time There Thank you Mac Alright I assume that's your fire well then have fun with it It ain't mine I, I said it was mine but it's not I lied Sorry for being a liar Okay are there any spirit pieces stuck up here? Yes of course there is there's always one There's always one well, then the hope is that I can maybe catch it on the other side by going through my waterfall path. Let's have a look-see. Oh, hey. There's one by my waterfall path. Okay, I'll come back for that one. That one's a little easier. Let me go to the top. And let me be on the lookout. Come on, tell me that spirit piece is up here. Ah. Nope. It is not up here. Okay, well. 
We're gonna go back then. I just saw Charlize leave her house? It psyched me out. I'm not used to always seeing my villagers leave their houses. It's like a rare opportunity. It's quite nice. Okay, there. A much more accessible spirit piece. That's only spirit piece number two, though. Uh, let me catch the other two. And then that one that spawned over the lake will hopefully move when I go back inside a building and back outside. Oh, Pietro, is that your fire? Who, who lit that fire? That's what I want to know. Oh, hey, there's a spirit piece. All right, number three. Great. Let's search the island for one more. And then, as I said, I'll go inside, come back outside. And maybe some more moths or something will spawn too, make my bug catching a little easier. Hmm. Okay. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Hmm. Nope. Nothing yet. Okay. Let me check the beach, and then I'll check the right side of the island, and we'll do a big ol' loop around. All right, and nothing there. Hmm. And nothing here. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm looking though. I'm, I'm trying. Just there's ants. That's good. More ants. More bug catching. Yes, thank you. All right. What else we got? What else we got? Where are more? Is that a hermit crab? No, that's an actual shell. Okay. I, th I think I swung my net. At that exact shell already now that I think about it. I don't know. Alright, now there could be a dung beetle up here as well. Be on the lookout for that. And that there is, okay. Got it! Thank you. Alright. You know what? You can you can move this. I'll take that. Thank you. Oh, okay. So we're gonna swap it. That 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 dung beetle has got to go. Okay. Great. So now Looking for Wisp Spirit Piece. Not back there. Hmm. Oh, it's right here. Great! It was right in front of my face! Now if I just go inside and come back outside of another building, it should be... I should reset things, so... Oh, I just scared away the bug! No! Alright. Nobody's home. Everyone's actually out and about at this hour? Insanity. Or they're sleeping. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Wendy is home. Hi, Wendy! I'm gonna come inside and... Uh, give you a bug, I guess, and then I'm gonna leave. Here we go. Oh, you're crafting something. Uh, frick, Wendy, come on. All right. Aw, oh, thank you, Wendy. What are you making? A cherry lamp. I actually don't think I know how to make that. Let's see. Because I'm building a thing. Really? The one day? The one day? That someone has a new recipe is the day that my pockets are full? Really? Oh my freaking goodness. Alright, give me a moment. I'll go back and get it. Oh my god. Alright, give me a moment. I was gonna give you something, Wendy. Frick. Alright, let's go. Let's get that cherry lamp. Yay, I'm, you know what? I should be thankful. I'm glad that I'm learning a new recipe. Alright? I'll get it crafted one of these days. Here we go. What's up? All right, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, there, and then this, and then this, and we are learning it. Thank you, Wendy. All right, well, I guess we may as well see what it looks like, right? All right, and then it's it, it's about what I expected. It's cherries, but I imagine they light up. Cool. Cool. Okay, well, awesome. That'll do. Okay. Well, hey. Are there any additional bugs that I can catch on the way down? Otherwise, I will just I will just walk past here, no problem. All right, go back. Go back up there a little bit, would you? Make me nervous being that close to the water. And then no citrus longhorn beetles. Okay, so I'm not seeing any extra bugs. So I just got to be on the lookout for a spirit piece. That's Wisp himself. Let me not bonk him with a net, huh? And then, ba, 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 ba. maybe I won't do deep sea diving today. Oh, perfect! The last wisp spirit piece is just in the woman's restroom. Ah, uh, why do they always end up in the woman's side and not the men's side? Hmm. Okay, but yeah, I think I'm actually gonna pass on deep sea diving today, just because I'm already kind of doing a lot with the wisps and the and the getting the fish bait today. So we're just gonna finish catching fish and bugs today, because those are the major ones. And I'm gonna have to do 
some deep sea diving in the months of February and March anyway, so there will be future opportunities, I'm sure. Alright, there you go. Excellent. Cool. Alright, so let's see, what are you giving me today? Well, who doesn't love furniture? Okay. Something new, please. What you got? Something I don't have yet. Okay. An inflatable sofa! That sounds hype. Thank you, Wes. Alright. Any more ants back in my little ant area? I'll go check real quickly and then we'll we'll meet the fishing and oh. Okay. As I was saying, we'll meet the fishing and bug catching quotas for the day. And then we'll be done. And cool, that's an extra bug. And that's an extra bug. Okay, so I need to check the numbers again. I know I said the numbers earlier, but I did just catch two more bugs, so I guess it doesn't hurt to check them again. Alright, let me see. Great. So that's we need to get 30 more fish exactly. And we need to get 23 more bugs. Okay. I can do that. I can do that. So let's go over here. Oh, you know, we said I didn't want to go off the on the fishing dock, right? We said it was actually better if I went to a different part of the... Oh, hey, look, already more. And there's a fish right there, too. Okay, I'll catch that fish. And then I'll use 29 bags of fish bait. Okay, here we go. Let's get this. Here we go. Boom. Extra fish without the need of fish bait. You're not going to see that. Wow. What a shame. Try this. All right. There you go. There. It's already on. Perfect. I love it when it's quick. Extra fishy. All right. Okay. And let it go. Okay. Good, 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 good. So now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go over here. I'm going to fish at this part of my island. 29 more bags of fish bait. Easy peasy. So all I really got to do then is I got to... Okay, I mean, I'll, I'll use 28 more bags of fish bait. How about that? And then I'll just catch one extra fish without the need of fish bait. So I'll just go through these chunks right here. That way I can better keep track of things. So, papa, sea bass, cool, whatever. Whew! Yeah, we are, we are, this is a long video. I mean, look, I don't think we're over time yet. I'm a little not sure because I had to edit out certain parts at the beginning of this video, but at least for this chunk of the video, I've already been recording for 37 minutes, and I think the introduction part was about 20 minutes. So we're already about to hit the hour mark, and I haven't met the fish catching or bug catching quotas yet. But we're, we're I mean, we're gonna hit them. I've got the fish bait. I, I hate that I'm not doing deep sea diving today, but I think it's for the best. I can't have these videos keep going on for, oh, so long. So we're just gonna... Make all this work as best as I can. So I apologize if this video was a little disorganized and, well, messy. But hey, it's all going to get done in the end. And my friends really are helping me out. And they deserve their recognition. And I want them to know that I am thankful. And I figured catching that on video is important anyway. Because I'm trying to document everything that I do in Animal Crossing. So that was part of the process. So let this go. You know, I try to I, I try to document everything I can, even if it's not the most fun thing in the world, like me catching all these fish right now, or like that time when my turnip prices were over 500 bells, and I had a bunch of people come to my island, but the game was just so slow, and then Twitter crashed on that day too, and my Twitter DMs didn't work, <laughs> so I couldn't communicate with anybody. Uh, yeah. So you know, it's all part of the process. The whole point of documentation is to, is to document both the highs and the lows. And while this isn't terrible, I gotta document it. Oh, this is a heavy one, isn't it? There it is. Yep, that's the ore fish. Well, I guess I'll hang on to this. Hey, Tybalt, you want this one? Here. Here you go. Wait, let the hermit crab go. Tybalt, you can have an ore fish. This is for you. Yeah, you can have it. There you go. All right. Yes, sir. Okay. Nice. Pilot shades. Nice. Thank you. All right. Back to fishing, if you don't mind. Okay. Anyway, I feel it's important to highlight when my friends give me stuff, too. Because they could have easily just, you know, mailed the items to me, but they thought it was easier to drop it off. So I wanted to document that. And I thought I... I, I didn't know how available my friends would be on a different day at a different time. But I prefer to get these items sooner rather than later. So I decided to make myself available 
earlier on in the day, get the fish bait, and then record the rest of the video now. And even if that leads to a more disorganized video, it leads to a more comfortable time for me to record in general. Basically what I'm trying to say is, I apologize that this isn't the best video I've made on my channel, but I think it's far from the worst. Alright? I don't think I'm gonna look at this video and give it a trophy and be like, Oh man, the best video I ever made was Animal Crossing Day 297. No way that's gonna exist when days like 143 exist. <laughs> but in any case, I think that things are fine and that I am merely overreacting. So let's get more fish. Let's meet today's quota. And then we will be fine. Great. Thank you. And then eventually, my fishing count is going to catch up to my bug count because I'm catching 50 fish a day, but only 40 bugs every day. So when they are even, I'll probably catch the same amount every day. Now, whether that means I'll be dropping the amount of fish I catch every day to 40 or raising the amount of bugs I catch every day to 50, I'm not sure yet. But one of those things will most likely happen. And I guess it would make more sense for me to try and catch 50 bugs every day because then I can be done with the Nook Miles achievement sooner rather than later and I really gotta pick up the pay pick up the pace because I've been devoting too many days to you know getting fish bait and messing around so I should be catching more each day and not lowering it but we'll see we'll see we'll I'll do oh this is the other fish that's that yeah you can just tell you can tell based on the way the joy cons vibrate good job developers and designers here I'll let it go if I get another one I'll keep it and I'll give it to another villager all right there we go. Almost done. Almost done. But see, if I didn't have the fish bait, I'd be doing this, but it would be taking longer because I'd have to be running around. And although me running around, I guess, makes for a visual change of pace, it's not worth my time. It would take like three times the amount of time to get the work done. So all this fish bait really, 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 really helps. Although I suppose I could go to a Nook Miles Island too, but nah, not today. Okay, wait. There it is. Thank you. We're getting it. We're getting it. Okay. So it should only be... I still have to get one more without the need of fish bait, right? So I still have to get 14 more or 15 more? Let's see. Wait. There it is. Okay. Thank you. We're going. We're doing it. And let it go. Hang on. Is there a bug in the background? There is. Hey, damselfly. I would like to catch you because you're going to help me toward my bug quota. Thank you. Awesome, I'm glad you came to me. Makes things a lot easier. Alright, goodbye damselfly. Alright, now then. Back to the... Well, first... No, no, no. First we get the fish bait out. And then we go back to the fishing. Okay, there it is. And... Hey! That's not gonna work. That simply will not do. Try that. There you go, you see it. Oh, it's already on! Perfect! Awesome! Okay. Well, great. And then let it go. Alright, and then we're just, we're gonna go down here again, and we are gonna continue. So here we go. Alright, extra fish. Come on, make it simple. It's okay if it's a sea bass. Make it fast, too. Make it snappy. Although about that night, you begin to think I want a red snapper, which is fine, too, just as long as it's snappy. Snappy. That was a good snap. Yeah, no, no, those, those are good snaps. All right. You know, for the longest time, I didn't know how to snap. I can also only do it with my left hand. I, I can kind of do it with my right. Oh, I have to, okay, I can't mess around with my right hand too much. I have to use it to press the A button. Well, I guess I could press the A button with my left hand. It's a little weird. The right Joy-Con was made for right hands when held vertically. All right, here we go. Final set of fish bait that I'm using for the day. There it is. So yeah, I guess I can snap with my right hand. I just usually don't because I'm left-handed. My snaps with my left hand sound a lot better though. Okay. Well, here we go. Almost done. <sighs> so much fish bait. So glad to have it all. Thank you, Lee and Emma. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. I'm just glad that there is a mechanic that makes fishing easier. And I'm glad that I have friends that are willing to get me the item that allows me to take advantage of said mechanic. Right, wait. This is another ore fish. I'm keeping it. This is big enough to be an ore fish. Very slow. 
There it is. Now nah, this is a sea bass. It's not making huge vibration noises. Yep. See, those sound effects matter. It, it helps with that immersion, even though Animal Crossing's not necessarily a game I want to feel realistic. But, I mean, there is a sense of immersion with the customization of this game. So, they, I guess the developers and designers figured, well, to really get that sense of immersion, let's make the bugs and the fish have your controllers vibrate differently based on what happens around you. That's kind of neat. Same thing with the deep sea dive. Oh, no! Deep sea diving, I think, vibrates the same way every time. But the bugs, you know, when you get attacked by a tarantula, it's kind of silly. Makes your controllers vibrate. Get that, what's it called? Receptive feedback? It's kind of nice. The idea of, like, making your hits feel powerful when you push a button in a video game, or the idea of really feeling like you got hit when something happens in a video game, or in this case, me going fishing. I really feel like I'm bringing in a big fish based on how my controller vibrates. It's important. It's not a thing that many people really care about, and it doesn't always matter, but it helps. And it's really nice when you get it right, because now I'm having a whole conversation about it. Alright, there we go. Tiny fish. Tiny fish. Wait. Wait. There it is. Okay. We're all set. Thank you. Awesome. Cool. And let it go. Excellent! Alright. Good, 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 good. Okay. That. Wait. Wait. There it is. Okay, thank you. Almost done. And then I still gotta go and catch one more fish without the need of fish bait. And then I'll actually be done. And then we can just focus on bugs. And then I will try to catch all three fish, bugs, and deep sea creatures tomorrow. And we'll be good. Because then I'll still... I still have plenty of fish bait. So I should just be able to power through tomorrow. At least Wisp showing up today added for a nice change of pace too. I only have to help him one more time. And then that Nook Miles achievement will finally be done. So I just have to hope that he shows up between now and the next 60 days or so. Or so. Darn it. Darn it all. Okay, I've still got six tree branches, so that's fine. Yeah, I break so many tree branches a day. Oh, wow, okay. Hang on, wait. Really? There. Alright, what's this? I hope it's a fishing rod. Here, wait. Release this. Okay, now what... Is this though? This is open that up. Oh, uh, skull door plate, huh? I feel like Tyball just gave me one of those. This game wants to give me a bunch of skulls, huh? Hmm. Alrighty, here. Let's craft another flimsy fishing rod and then upgrade it to a regular fishing rod. So, tools. Uh oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> Bless me, thank me. Alright, so get that. Upgrade that to a regular fishing rod. And I suppose I'll take a photo with my villagers over here real quickly. So, let me get this. And then let me do that. Alright. Very good. Thank you. Alright, all done for now. Good, good, good. Hey, guys. That fire's still here, huh? And it feels nice. That's good. Okay, here, let me hold that. Hope you don't mind. Let me do this. Let me do this. Let me sit down with you all. Because now I can do that. And I'll do this. Awesome. That's a nice picture. Okay. So I gotta catch you. That's the one fish I'll catch without the need of fish bait or something. So get that. Wait. Oh, Mac changed his outfit. Awesome. He took off his glasses and he got a bug catching net out. He was wearing glasses, right? I'm not crazy about that. Uh, uh, okay. Very good. Well, that'll do. Thank you. All right, and then we're gonna let it go. Okay, right, I needed to get rid of one more bag of fish bait. Two more bags of fish bait, okay. Well, let's do it, let's head over here. Now, if there's already a fish over here, I'll catch it too and I'll just have an extra fish today. Nope, okay. Hang on. That's a bug, I have to get that. It'll help me with my bug catching quota, so there. All right, and then let it go. Nice to get an extra bug in the form of a hermit crab. All right. Back to the fishing rod. Now we do this. Two more fish, and then I'll have caught 50 fish today. Whoop! Nice. All right. Try that. Wait. Okay, awesome. I believe this one's going to be a sea bass. And there's an olive flounder. Okay. Oh, cool. All right, let it go. And then... Ba -ba 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 -ba. 
last bag of fish bait for the day, and then whatever fish I catch from it will actually be able to fit in my inventory slot. So I'm going to go sell stuff afterward. Okay, it's on. Awesome. Actually, you know what I might do? I think what I'd rather do is I'm going to pick up this shell. I mean, unless it's a bug, but I think we established this one's an actual shell, right? So I'll take this, and then we are going to swap it for that fish I just caught. Yeah. And then we're going to go sell some stuff, and then we are going to go bug catching. Hmm. I'm not seeing any moths. That's fine. We'll be on the lookout. There might be more ants. Let's see. So let's sell. Boom, 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 boom. I am going to sell the pilot shades. I'm sorry. I should hang on to the inflatable sofa, though. Wisp gave that to me, and I never had one before. Oh, hang on. Then the extra... We'll sell the extra fish that was over here. Cool. Goodbye. Sell. All right. And then we got to move this to over there. All right. Good. Keep my net out. Excuse me, Tybo. You're wearing the pancake hat! How fun. How fun. That's been in my shop for a long time. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Alright, no moths immediately. Any moths in front of my house? Okay, nothing. Hmm. Nothing. Just nothing. Okay, well, are there at least ants? And then I'll check the right side of my island for beetles. Gotta catch some more bugs, please. Not even butterflies. No ants either? What the heck's happening? What is, what is happening? Do I have to go inside and come back outside? Okay, no. I'm taking the shell. That's like the third time I've smacked my net against that exact shell. So here we go. Let's get that move on. Hmm. 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 No dung beetles. Oh, oh! Oh! Hang on a second. Hey, tarantula. Hey, tarantula. Hey, tarantula. Ah, darn it. <laughs> it wasn't looking at me. I tried to get its attention. Oh, I even, okay. Man. Darn it. It's not going to be there anymore. Doggone it. Frick. I still haven't gone to Tarantula Island yet, either. You know, maybe tomorrow I will use a Nook Miles ticket. Just to kind of mix things up some more. Maybe. That's not a promise. It's just something I'm thinking about now that that Tarantula bit me. Because tomorrow, I could play in the evening. And... If I play in the evening and wind up on Tarantula Island, that's perfect. Ooh. Okay. Extra bug. Awesome. Alright, let me, let me cover up these holes. Clean up the mess I made. Oh, damselfly. Okay. Great. Extra bug. So how many more bugs do I need? Like 10? I think I need a lot. Let me see. I need... Okay, so I'm at 2868. I need to be at 2886. So, yeah, I have to get 18. Frick. Everything's so slow today. Alright, I'm sorry. I'm looking for citrus longhorn beetles. Or moths. Or another tarantula if one dares to challenge me again. I just keep losing that battle. At least I caught enough fish. I did catch enough fish, right? I guess I never checked. That should be at 2362. And it is. Perfect. Okay. Well, fine. You know, I'm gonna get some extra tree branches so I can craft another net or fishing rod when one inevitably breaks in the next video. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Fine, I'll take these two tree branches. <gasps> Bug. Bug. No! Ah! Okay, hang on. Bug. No! Ah, oh, now I really can't get you. Frick, man! The amblefly finally shows up and I just can't get it. Okay, lots and lots of tree branches, though. That's good. Okay, good. 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 Oh, where did that damselfly go? I think that's a lost cause now. Darn it. Frick. Alright, and then any citrus longhorn beetles up here? I'm, I'm getting a little desperate now. I really gotta make sure I, I keep up with my quotas. I can't keep cutting things off early today, but I might have to. This video's already gonna go on for so long. Ah! Oh! oh man, I missed that damselfly. Hmm. Well, maybe if I go down to the beach, there could be a hermit crab or a wharf roach or something. Let me look. Let me look. Okay, there could be wharf roaches up top here. And there are not. 
Ugh, okay. I just, I don't, I don't know what to say. I don't know where anything is. Ah! Uh, I don't know! Hopefully, uh, okay, I was gonna say, that shell was not there earlier. I made sure I picked up that other shell before. Okay, so cool, that's another bug. How about some ants? Anything. Dude, what happened to my ants? I used to, I, I, I was able to count on them in the past. And now there's nothing. No ants. What the frick? Alright, any moths? Come on, tell me there's some moths. Please. No moths. No moths! Why? Why are there no moths? What if I go inside, I drop off the inflatable mattress, and then I come back outside? That'll reset some bugs, and that might cause some moths to spawn, right? So there's that chance. Oh, it's gonna be so much easier to catch bugs when springtime rolls around again. Alright. So this... Put that in storage, and I don't know, an extra dung beetle or something, we'll put that in storage too, I don't know, I guess the conch can go in storage, okay, good, let's get out of here, I'm just filling up my storage with items I don't really need, but I'm, I'm just hoping for the best, okay, no moth, no moth, we're off to a pretty rough start, maybe some ants, I could always bonk a rock, alright, let's bonk a rock, we go back up here, and take this, let me take this, and then, it's the money rock! Alright, the money rock is nice and all, but I actually wanted to bonk a different type of rock. Because I wanted to try and get a bug to potentially come out of it. It's okay. Alright, extra money, I guess. Extra money! I can buy tools or something tomorrow. I don't, I don't know, customization blocks or something. I don't really need to buy anything from the shop ever again. Unless I really, you know, get stuck and I need to find a specific piece of furniture. But, otherwise, this is about it. I don't, I, I'm knocking out so many Nook Miles achievements that I'm really going to have no reason to play this game after I knock them all out. Alright, let me take all these. Good, 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 good. Okay. So, not, not, no, no, not seeing any extra hermit crabs. Didn't see any wharf roaches up top, and if they were there, oh, there is a moth though. Come here, moth. Okay, that's good. That's very good. Okay. Any other moths want to make themselves known? It'd be very handy right about now. I still have to catch like 15 more bugs. I think I'm still at 18. I didn't catch any earlier, right? No, I caught, I caught a dung beetle. Well, I don't know. We'll check in a moment. Come on, ants. I'm counting on you. Yes, the ants are back. All right, now let me go back to the left and see if the moths have respawned. And then if the moths have respawned, I'll come back over here and see if the ants are res have respawned and I'll keep zigzagging. Come on. Let's do it. Let's power through the bug quota today. Let's get this done. Okay, come on. Yes! Perfect! Oh, I hope this is the case. I will power through this bug quota right now. Alright, so how many more bugs do I need? Let me see. So we are at 2872. Okay, I have to get 14 more. 14 more. Let's go. Let's freaking go! Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. <laughs> Come on, more ants. More ants, more ants, more ants. Darn it, no more ants! Well, is there, at least, is there at least another moth if I go back? Darn it, no! I don't want to be 14 bugs short today. Come on, moth. Tell me there's another moth over here. Darn it, no! <laughs> Frick! I need more bugs. Alright, let's do a loop. Let me check my house. Nope, no moths there. Not seeing any damselflies, not seeing any butterflies, not seeing any tarantulas, not seeing any wharf roaches, not seeing any hermit crabs. Hopefully I'll see some beetles, or hopefully on the way back now I'll see some ants. I don't know. Come on. Ants, please. Yay, there are ants, and I think that shell, that shell to the lower left is going to be a hermit crab. Let's find out. Boom! Okay, two more bugs, just like that. I want to go check the moths again again. So let it go. Very good. Ah, frick! Alright, well, it's a good thing I got those extra tree branches. Let me run over to the left. Oh, you know what? Let me run over to the right and use the workstation over here. It's closer. And chances are, in going over here and then running back to the left, ants could spawn again. So, let's see. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. And thank you. Alright. Keep crafting. And then, boom, boom, boom. Alright. 
And thank you. Done. Alright, where was I? Let's get that net back out. Here we go. And see, just like that, there are more ants. That's much better. Now I'm powering through this. Now I'm feeling a whole lot. I'm feeling, I'm feeling great. Okay, here we are. Let's go check for more moths. And then I'll check for ants here. And then I will loop around. Check for beetles. Check for damselflies. Maybe another tarantula. I don't know. Tell me there's a moth over here. Come on. There was a moth consistently. Ah, I say consistently. It spawned there twice. There was that one time when so many moths spawned right in front of the Able Sisters light, though. I just want that to happen again. That, or I need to go to another Nook Miles Island where there's 110 damselflies I can catch again. But we'll see. Any more ants? There are ants. Good. Okay. Great. No, no, no. No, I, I did not mean to hit swap it. Fine. Swap it for the moth, I guess. Lots of ants in my pockets. Cool, whatever. Maybe that moth going back in the wild will make another moth spawn on top of one of these lights and I can just catch it. Hopefully, I wish. But I doubt it. Yeah. Well, I'm up here now, which means there's room for opportunity in me catching beetles. Nothing on that tree stump. I'm not seeing any dung beetles pushing these snowballs. And I'm not seeing any beetles on these. Oh, there is one on that stump. Okay, cool. Give me one moment. I could always catch a mole cricket, but I really don't want to. <laughs> I just want to keep my net out and swing it. I don't want to have to get the shovel out to catch a bug unless it's involved, unless it involves me bonking a rock. All right, no, yeah, there's not going to be any moths up here because nobody has their lights on because everyone's out and about. Wendy's home, but that's about it otherwise. Okay, well, let me go back down. Maybe some more citrus longhorn beetles will spawn or maybe dung beetles spawn now. Let's see. Dung beetles? No. No worries. Okay. Well, I... We'll loop back around and try to catch some, catch some ants. Try to look for butterflies or hermit crabs or anything. Let's run along the beach. Come on, hermit crabs. Where are you at? No hermit crabs. No hermit crabs. Okay. No worries. There are ants. Okay, these ants are becoming reliable again. You have regained my trust, you ants. Under normal circumstances, you would be a pesky bug, but you are really helpful here. All right, so what? Eight more, I think, is what I'm at? Eight more, yeah. Okay. Hang on, one of my Nook Miles achievements is almost done for the day. Which one is that? I'll sell, earn bells by selling items? Okay, fine. I'll go sell stuff right now. I, I want to go back in that direction to try and catch a moth anyway if one spawns. So, looking. Hmm. Nothing. Okay. Well, let's sell. And then we do boom, 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 boom. Boom, and then extra rocks. And I have exact, oh, not the shovel. And then I have exactly 30 pieces of clay, huh? How oh, nice. Cool. Well, that got me some extra, some extra Nook Miles. That's kind of neat. Thank you. I'm not focusing on these anymore. Just want to get that little thing because I was already close to completing it. Any hermit crabs down here? No. Any wharf roaches up here? No. Okay. And then I'm going to go inside. I'm going to come back outside. And I'm going to hope that more bugs will have spawned at that time. Come on. Oh, okay. And now I'm heading back out. Uh. Uh. Yeah, there is a moth. It was worth it. Darn it. Well, it's a good thing me swinging my net near you doesn't make you go away like it does when I miss a dung beetle or something. Great. That's much better. Seven more bugs to go and then I can end today's video. Come on. I'm already forfeiting the deep sea creatures today. I should not forfeit the bugs they have to catch either. And if there are ants here, then there'll only be six more bugs they have to catch. Okay, great. Six more to go! Six more! Ah! Let's go back to the left and see if another moth has potentially spawned. I would love to keep zigzagging. I really would. Come on, six more bugs. Six more bugs. Oh, sorry, Mac. Six more bugs. Nothing there. And then, nothing in front of my house. Hmm. Let's go inside resident services and come back out. I wonder if that's like a thing. If you go inside carrying a bug catching net at nighttime and the stores have closed and most people are outside and then you walk back outside, you're guaranteed to see a moth <laughs> right next to where you are. No, it's definitely not a thing. I was really hopeful there. 
Oh, I like lost balance in my. <laughs> I like lost balance in my chair. Oh, I said that. Sorry. This is me being an idiot. Nothing new. Hey, there, there is a moth over here, though. So that's good. All right. Great. That's what I said. Six more or five more now. No, not that one. Five more! Five more! Let's go check the ants again, and then we'll check the moths again, and then we'll check the ants again. Come on. I want the zigzagging pattern to be a thing. Come on. We can do it. And then ants, okay. Four more. Four more. Oh. 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 Let's do it. 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 No, that was a snowflake, okay. But if a damselfly wants to appear, that'd be very great. Okay, you know, I'm gonna go inside and come back outside. And then if there's no moth this time, then forget it. I'm just gonna loop around the island again. Rely on beetles and whatnot. Alright, back out. Come on, four more bugs. Tell me there's a moth here. I can catch it. Then it'll just be three more. Yes! Thank you! This is the place. This is the place for moths. Okay, three more. Let's go check the ant stash. And then there's no moth in front of resident services. Oh, there is a moth in front of resident services. Okay. Excellent. Two more. Let's check the ants. Okay. Oh, man. I'm going to be so done. This is going to be so great. And that fish bait helped so much. And the lights are helping with these moths. Okay. Good. No ants, darn it. It got my hopes up. Alright, well, let's wrap around. Check for wharf roaches, hermit crabs. Check for beetles. Okay, come on. Not seeing anything over here. No. Not seeing any dung beetles. Okay. I'm not seeing anything over here. Okay, well, fine. How about one extra tree branch for good luck? Thank you. Good luck, tree branch. Okay. What else we got? Have the dung beetles spawned now? No, there's nothing. There is nothing here. You're all okay. All right. Let me check back down. Let me catch an ant, please. And then it'll only be one more stinking bug. It can even be a dung beetle because it said stinking bug. There it is. Okay, one more, one more bug. One more bug. <sighs> You know, earlier I said it makes more sense for me to add the amount of add to the amount of bugs I have to catch every day rather than take away from it. Well, if it's taking me this long to catch 40 bugs, I don't know how I'd ever catch 50 bugs in a day. But at least it wouldn't be winter anymore, so maybe more bugs will spawn. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, not seeing any bugs over here. Maybe when I go back down, some more ants will spawn, and I just need to catch it. And then I'll be at two eight eight six bugs. And then I shall soon be past 3,000 bugs, and it's going to feel so much better. Uh, come on. Tell me there are ants back. Yes! The ants are back! Ah, okay! So, I met my bug catching and fishing quota. Yeah, I have to, I can't do the deep sea diving quota today. I mean, I could, but I, I shouldn't. So, just to verify, that puts us at my numbers of 2362 fish and 2886 bugs very good well for now that wraps up today's video of animal crossing new horizons and i would like to thank you all so much for watching i hope to see you all in future videos i'm gonna check the museum one more time and see if there's a moth in front of it wait is that a bug right there okay one extra bug for good luck make future days easier there extra bug for good luck can't carry it no worries i still want to check in front of the museum see if there's a moth Okay, there probably won't be. You never know. There is not. No worries. All right, there after today's video. I like to thank you all for watching. I hope to see you on future videos. Bye bye, humans. Whoosh. Hey, thank you for watching my video. If you want to continue to support my content, the best thing you can do is like this video and subscribe to my channel. All you have to do is click the little buttons down below. Also, please be sure to follow me on Twitter to stay up to date with my video schedule. My tag is at RealYoShiller. I hope to see you all in future videos. Bye bye. Whoosh.